Now I will help you learn how to compare length. Length is the horizontal distance from one end of an object to the other end. Now let's compare some objects and see which are longer than others and which are the longest. This is a chili. This chili is longer. This chili is the longest. This is a broom. This broom is longer. This broom is the longest. Longer, longest, longer, longest. Next, we learn about shorter and shortest. This is a cucumber. This cucumber is shorter. This cucumber is the shortest. This is a thermometer. This thermometer is shorter. This thermometer is the shortest. Shorter. Shortest. Shorter. Shortest. Super easy. Let's do it now. Do these watches have the same length? Yes. Super. Do these watches have the same length? No. Bravo. Which sword is longer? You're doing great. Which key is longer? Yeah. Which comb is shorter? That's right. Which one is the longest? Which one is the longest? That's it. Which one is the shortest? Good going. Which one is the shortest? the shortest caterpillar to the box perfect move the longest carrot to the box the shortest rolling pin to the box fantastic put the ships in order from the longest to the shortest Great job! Put the dogs in order from the longest to the shortest. Awesome! Put the buses in order from 
the shortest to the longest. Bravo! Which pencil is longer? Good thinking. Which sword is shorter? Great. Which key is shorter? Good job. Move the longest screwdriver to the box. Bravo! Move the longest screwdriver to the box. Excellent. Put the thermometers in order from the shortest to the longest. Great job! Put the brooms in order from the shortest to the longest. Good thinking! Let's play a game! Choose your character. Nat, Dan, and Finn are in a race. Tap on the longest bar to help your character win the race. Tap on the shortest bar to help your character win the race. Tap on the longest bar to help your character win the race. Measure length using a non-standard unit. In this lesson, we will learn how to measure length with a non-standard unit. There are many objects in our daily life that can be used to measure length without a ruler. They are called as non-standard units. Now, let's learn how to use cubes as a non-standard unit to measure length. Remember to use cubes that are all the same size. We are going to measure the length of this pencil. Make sure the cubes go from the very beginning of the pencil to the very end. We put cubes in a straight line from end to end without making any gaps. Look, we used five cubes to measure the pencil. So we can say 
This pencil is five cubes long. Let's make another example using cubes to measure length. This is a key. We put cubes in a straight line from the very beginning of the key to the very end. The key is three cubes long. What about sausage? The sausage is seven cubes long. To compare the lengths of objects, we should put them in the same line. As we can see, the pencil is longer than the key, and the key is shorter than the pencil. When comparing three things, we can see that the sausage is the longest and the key is the shortest. Ready? Let's practice! Drag the cubes to measure the shovel. How many cubes long is the shovel? the cubes to measure the shovel. How many cubes long is the shovel? That's it! Drag the cubes to measure the shovel. How many cubes long is the shovel? Fantastic! Measure the length of the different things. Measure the length of the different things. Measure the length of the different things. Well done! the length of different things. Measure the length of different things. That's right!
measure length using a ruler. Now, I will help you learn how to measure length using a ruler. In many places, length is measured in centimeters and meters. We use length to measure things like shapes and objects in daily life. We can use a desk ruler, which is very common in schools, or a tape measure. Let's see how we use a desk ruler to measure the lengths of objects in centimeters. Firstly, line up the eraser with the ruler. Then, align one end of the eraser with the zero mark on the ruler. Pay attention to the other end of the eraser to get the result. The eraser is five centimeters long. Let's use another example. How long is the crayon? Well, the crayon is seven centimeters long. What about the pencil? The pencil is 10 centimeters long. Get ready, let's practice now. Use the ruler to measure the length of the watch. Drag the number to its correct place. Use the ruler to measure the length of the screwdriver. Drag the number to its correct place. Great job! Use the ruler to measure the length of the spanner. Drag the number to its correct place. Super duper! Use the ruler to measure the length of the shovel. Drag the number to its correct place. Good job! Use the ruler to measure the length of objects. Drag the number that shows the length of each object. Super duper! Use the ruler to measure the length of objects. Drag the number that shows the length of each object.
Good job! Use the ruler to measure the length of objects. Drag the number that shows the length of each object. Use the ruler to measure the length of objects. Drag the number that shows the length of each object. Fantastic! Use the ruler to measure the length of the skateboard. Drag the number to its correct place. Yeah! Use the ruler to measure the length of objects. Drag the number that shows the length of each object. That's right! Use the ruler to measure the length of the knife. Drag the number to its correct place. Good going! A new lesson is ready for your treasure hunt. Compare height. Now, I will help you learn how to compare height. Height is the vertical distance from the top of an object to its base. Now, let's compare the heights of some objects. This is a baby. This boy is taller than the baby. This man is the tallest. This is a lighthouse. This lighthouse is taller than the other one. This lighthouse is the tallest. Taller. Tallest. Taller. Tallest. Now we are going to learn about shorter and shortest. This is a candle. This candle is shorter. This candle is the shortest. This is a milk bottle. This milk bottle is shorter. This milk bottle is the shortest. Shorter. Shortest. Shorter. Shortest. Would you like to try? Let's do it! Do they have the same height? No. Great! Do they have the same height? No. Excellent! Which is taller? Perfect! Which is taller? Super duper! 
which is taller. Super. Which is shorter. Which is shorter? That's it. Which is shorter? That's it. Which one is the tallest? Which one is the tallest? Super duper. Which one is the shortest? Bravo. Which one is the shortest? That's right. Which one is the shortest? Good thinking. Put the girls in order from the shortest to the tallest. Super duper. Put the boys in order from the tallest to the shortest. Good job. Move the shortest cup to the box. The tallest Christmas tree to the box. Good job. Put the roses in order from the tallest to the shortest. That's it. Put the electric fans in order from the tallest to the shortest. Good going. Let's play a game. On the ball that has the shortest object. Awesome! Kick on the ball that has the tallest object. Awesome! Kick on the ball that has the shortest object. <laughs> 